Big food brands are joining the metaverse. They're not just issuing trademarks, but real plans on how they'll use the technology. Is the metaverse set to become a multi-billion dollar industry? I'm Holly Petrie, and this is NRN's Tech Tracker. Let's take it over to Joanna Fantosi and find out more. Well, we're really excited because we're starting to finally get real details from brands joining the metaverse. Previously, it was just these brands are filing trademarks, McDonald's, Burger King, um, uh, uh, Wingstop, a bunch of brands filed trademarks, but didn't really want to go into too much detail about what they're going to be doing within the metaverse. But we have our first two brands that are that will be uh, sharing some details with how they plan to use the virtual world uh, technology. So Wendy's uh, is creating uh, a virtual restaurant within the Wentleyverse, um, and they will allow fans to interact with each other and just kind of interact with the brand and play like mini games. Right now, we're not hearing anything quite yet about real life experiences and how that might connect um, with, let's say, like a loyalty program, but I think that that might be coming soon. Um, as for Chipotle, um, within the Chipotle uh, metaverse game, they're, as, uh, they're, they're kind of gamifying it. Um, so within, the, uh, within their metaverse, you can build a burrito. Um, it's, this is a limited time thing. I believe it's just for a couple of weeks. You can build a burrito and the first couple thousand or hundred thousand um, fans that create the burrito within the metaverse, within this virtual reality game, uh, will be able to get a coupon for a in real life entree. So you get a free burrito for doing that yourself. Um, not quite up to the point yet of them being able to show up at your door once you successfully uh, roll a virtual burrito, but probably again getting...